Hi, I'm Ms. Shell, and I want to welcome all of you parents and students to our fourth grade class. This year in our fourth grade math class, we're going to be doing more complicated, advanced, and challenging problems than in third grade, but hopefully it will be a lot more fun too. By now, all of you fourth graders should be able to add, subtract, multiply, and divide, as well as estimate, do some problems with probability, fractions, and keep building on top of your basic arithmetic skills. But don't worry, there will be plenty of review in the first couple of weeks to ensure that all the basic understandings and mechanics remain solid. Our math class is going to require active participation from all of our students. We will be using worksheets, games, hands-on activities, and be having assessments, both formal and informal. In our class, we're going to be working collaboratively and, in and independently. So during group work, it will be loud and very fun and interactive, but independent work needs to be taken seriously as well. Our math curriculum is going to be taught with relying heavily on worksheets and a lot of games and learning manipulatives and tools. The lessons will have activities, reinforcement exercises, and like I said before, they will end with formal or informal assessments. All topics that we're, are going to be covered in this class, not just arithmetic. We're going to cover number sense, algebra, geometry, spatial sense, measurement, link, and then we will link all concepts and procedures together. The Colorado model content standards that we will cover during this class for fourth grade include developing number sense and using numbers and number relationships in problem solving situations, using algebraic methods to explore, model, and describe patterns and functions involving numbers, shapes, data, and graphs, use data collection and analysis, statistics and probability in problem solving situations, use geometric concepts, properties, and relationships in problem solving situations, use a variety of tools and techniques to measure and apply these results in problem solving situations, and lastly, we will link concepts and procedures as they develop throughout our class. Some of the techniques that we will be linking together are estimation, mental arithmetic, paper and pencil activities, using calculators and computers, and all of this will be in problem solving situations. To tie together all of these content standards, we are going to communicate the reasoning that we solved, that we use for solving these problems. So in our class, there is going to be a lot of problem solving. Hopefully you guys are going to be as excited about this year in math class as I am. We're going to be learning, discovering, and exploring the world of mathematics. Parents, please feel free to communicate with me anytime you have questions, comments, concerns, or just want to stop on by our classroom. Contact me through email or phone. All of that information was sent to you guys in your welcome letter. Thank you, and we'll have a great year.